Could the violence in Haryana's loo be avoided? Was there enough indication for local authorities to take preventative action? The violence which erupted during the Braj Mandal Yatra on July 31st killed at least seven people in several parts of Haryana. The procession was organized by two Hindu right-wing outfits, the Vishwa Hindu Parishad and the Bajrang Dal. When the procession entered Nu, a district with a Muslim-majority population, locals started pelting stones. The crowd reportedly dispersed but regrouped and came back armed this time, causing widespread violence in the area and the neighbouring district of Gurugram, a region that shares its borders with New Delhi. Vehicles were torched, shops were gutted, and videos of this violence went viral online. So what could have stopped this? In the days leading up to the event, not only were several right-wing outfits posting videos stoking tension, but several handles were tagging local authorities asking for intervention. Logically, facts found that seemingly Muslim handles started tagging local authorities after a video of self-proclaimed cow vigilante Monu Manesar went viral. Up to 4,000 accounts had shared Manesar's video and several hundreds of thousands saw these posts. Manesar, who's been booked for the murder of two Muslim men and hasn't been arrested since February, announced that he will also be joining the Braj Mandal Yatra. A user also wrote that if any riots were to happen, the onus would lie on the Rajasthan and Haryana chief ministers. It was also reported that several Mewat locals also said that they were prepared for Monu Manesar's arrival. Members of the VHP and Bajrang Dal also posted videos online making incendiary statements. Kao Vigilante Bittu Bajrangi posted a slow-mo video of him walking to a song with the lyrics, Gunshots will be exchanged. It was captioned, I am coming. Another VHP member posted a video of him at a talk, saying that the people of Mewat should know that Hindus are awakening. The official handle of a group called the Jat Association wrote a post on X claiming that Hindus can only enter Mewa till sunset in fear of being attacked. Replying to this post, another group posted this video. चौरासी को रिक्स पर करना मैं पूछ रहा था जैसे मेवा क्षेत्र में जाओगे तो रात को निकल जाते नॉर्मली पर करना दे लोगे रुकोगे रुक ही सकता है और निकल भी में कोई दिक्कत ही ना आए पहले क्या था पहले तो मतलब घर उदम करे करते पर अब मतलब गुजर नहीं मारे मतलब कोई बना अगर गुजर ना हो तो गुजर ना हो तब तो मतलब बहुत बड़ा हंगामा है अगर गुजर ना हो दादा तो दिक्कत हो जाएगी क्या वहां मेवात में Our investigation shows that there was enough evidence in the days leading up to the event to indicate there could be a flare-up, with right-wing accounts posting provocative content, seemingly Muslim handles asking local authorities for help, some also threatening retaliation. Early measures by the authorities could have prevented the communal clashes, what is becoming a recurring theme amid religious festivals in India.